different people, but we see things differently, we're going to act differently, but as a society we must be open-minded about how we intermingle with other people. But, but can I say to you that I wanted to win again, to be, in, be there in the 1990s to see Australia prosper as it will. And that's how society must be able to slowly evolve in being able to be open-minded and see things differently. Hello, I am Martin Thomas. I'm a labourer. I'm 51 years of age. I have been married. I have four children, two boys, two girls. And when I go out socially, I dress up as a female and I have sex normally with males and I would go to the extreme of actually having a sex change operation if it was possible. Uh, from a young age, you know, I felt more comfortable if I'd been a female and not a male. And I've just had to accept being a male in this society and just do the, the male things. $2,000 buying a motorbike and he stripped it down, shoved it and charged me $4,000 for stuff that I don't want. The upbringing that you, you get, even though it's treated as a male, you know, but you, you get told things and you, you, know, you it, you get that imprint from from an early age. It's like society and how you know you're supposed to act and things like that, and how you should go through society because you know it comes down through your parents and how society see you and stuff like that. But it, it, it was also in getting told at a young age that I should have been a female and then having the heart condition where you, know, you sort of associate you know, hearts with females you know, through the family, that, that you sort of get that, oh, you know, that you're cursed. You know, there, there you go, there's an old expression that you're cursed. But, uh, but when you, you, you're seven years of age, it, you, you don't mentally, and you keep it to yourself. His attitude was um, join the um, ch cavalry because why walk when you can ride in armoured tanks? The upbringing that I received and what, what's how I, I perceived it and it did affect how I later on went on and have just pictured myself and then gone through life in that that mode. I've never sort of got over it. You know, so I, I'm not a, a social person, bec mainly I suppose because of it that you don't feel comfortable with it. But also, it, um, just not comfortable with other people. In that, I was don't expect to be never expected to be around long. But again, that that's nurtured. You know, that, that, that's little things that happen you now when you're young. In that, you know, my mother, you know, being so silly, you know, to say, you know, to, that keep you know, reminded me that, oh, no, I had my palm read and um, no, one of my children would die young. Uh, I mean, when they sort of worked out that, no, there was a, oh, I did have a heart problem, and you get told that at a young age that you're going to die young, you, you sort of why bother? Why go make friends? You ain't going to be here around very long. So just keep yourself and stay with yourself that when you die, no one's going to miss you. When Aubrey died in 2005 from a heart attack, Martin stopped for a couple of months. He said, that should have been me. Mm. It should have been me. Things that happen in your life um, affect what's going to happen later on. You know, it's one of those things, nurtured and natured, in that if I had been a, a healthy male, you know, and you know, 
I was a little mongrel as a kid, you know, I must admit. Uh, but, you know, if I just kept that going, you know, uh, more than likely, you know, would have gone on, you know, and and been done all the, the, the real male things, you know, stuff like that, and thought nothing of it. When I go out and to be myself and dress up, you know, and I go to the club, um, I, I, I feel more comfortable. You know, that's when I stand there and talk to people, you know, dressed as a female, I am comfortable and also comfortable in that what they see is how I feel and would like to be seen as. So, so going through and meeting people and trying to portray yourself you know, as a male, it, it, it is sort of, you get used to it, I suppose would be the easiest way to do it. You just get used to it and you just get on with it. Our society is such that it's not comfortable with a person like myself. Don't prejudge people through your own conceptions. Be open-minded about who you meet in society and also how you go through society yourself with an open mind. Hello, you've seen the other side of me as a male. This is the female side that I would rather be seen as. I am a teeter. Hello.